Now we're on our own in government, I believe we can be stronger. Our one nation approach will be tougher, fairer and faster. And that will start next week with a new immigration bill included in the Queen's speech. So first, dealing with those who shouldn't be here. That has to start with making Britain a less attractive place to come and work illegally. The truth is it's been too easy to work illegally and too easy to employ legal workers here in Britain. So we're going to take a radical step. We're going to make, it illegal, we're going to make illegal working a criminal offence in its own right. That means wages paid to illegal migrants can be seized as proceeds of crime. It means more businesses will be told when their workers' visas have expired. So if you're involved in illegal working, whether an employer or an employee, you are breaking the law. There are other ways we can identify those who shouldn't be here, for example, through housing. For the first time now, we've had landlords checking whether their tenants are here legally. And we'll change the rules so that landlords can evict illegal immigrants more quickly. We'll also crack down on the unscrupulous landlords who cram houses full of illegal migrants by introducing a new mandatory licensing regime. But it's not just through housing and jobs. We can track down illegal migrants through the banking system too. We've already made sure banks can't let illegal migrants open new accounts, and with our new bill, we'll ensure that banks take action against existing accounts held by those who are here illegally. Of course, once we've found people who are here illegally, we need to be better at removing them more swiftly. Now, as you know, we've already introduced a deport first, appeal later rule for foreign criminals claiming a so-called right to family life. It means if you've committed a crime and you're not meant to be here, you have to go home before you can appeal. Next, we're going to extend that to all immigration appeals, except, of course, asylum cases. Now, that is a big step. It prevents people from staying on and on with appeal after appeal. 